In bustling cities around the world, we walk each day. Hidden amongst the melodies of everyday life lies a group of people, artists known as buskers. They bring a unique charm to our towns and cities, entertaining many of us regularly. Here in Hillingdon, musicians say they face being silenced by council regulations making performances much more difficult. Hi guys, my name is Young Error, uh, spelled Y-V-N-G and then Error spelled Error. I'm a singer-songwriter from West London. You might regularly see me busking around Uxbridge. Uh, that's one of the hotspots I like to go. Being, being from the area, it's a great place for me to uh, you know, advertise my music and showcase my talent. But unfortunately, what's happened at the minute is the Hillingdon Council, they've implemented a £37.50 license fee, which enables you for two hours busking. And as many people are aware, that's a ridiculous amount of money that no one could afford. Um, being a you know upcoming singer songwriter, I I don't have that funding, nor do any of the other buskers. Uh, Camden has a fee, but that's 150 pounds for a two year, which you know in comparison, that's absolutely fine. You've got places such as Harrow, they give you free busking license if you just send that application online. Uh, Windsor, places like that, it's all free. As you know, over the last couple of years, we've had an extremely difficult time, and one of the biggest things that you know, us as humans have faced is not being able to be reconnected. So inevitably taking music away from this and stopping that, you're stopping people's happiness. So I thoroughly just enjoy performing my music, you know, getting better, practicing, making people smile. There's people that don't have anything to do with their days and that are lonely. So it gives them an opportunity, you know, to come out, to feel music. So it gives them and young kids the opportunity for the first time in their life to ever you know, witness live music and get a feel for it. And maybe in the future they'll end up doing something musical. So we've set up a petition uh, called Save the Music. And it's basically to try and change this rule and support arts and music for our community to bring us closer together again. We're gonna be setting up an online petition. If everyone can get behind it, that'll be absolutely fantastic. Hopefully we can get this music stuff up and running and everyone can enjoy themselves. Don't let Hiddenden silence the music. Sign our petition, join us now, and let music forever live on.